This is just a trip right here. I don't even want to touch this. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, pirates who are ready to unbox boxes from an executive television network person, storage unit of all ages. It's I, your captain speaking. We're here. I forgot. We got all this right back here to go through still. This is from those vaults. If you remember, we met Manny at that auction. Well, you guys met Manny. I've known him for a while. We bought the TV executive eight vaults for 2400 We still have this little bit to go from here over to there. It's like two rows. The letters are from the garbage unit. This is our dump run that we did when we did the Restores of Love video with that nice couple we gave back the stuff to. Anyway, enough talking. Let's get going through some boxes. And what is in here? Okay. We got a basket. Nice. That is about a 30 to $50 Dites, D-I-E-T-Z, railroad style lantern. $5 one of these. An $8 one of those. <sighs> this box is pretty well gone through already. That's just lovely. That's a good way to start this off. Huh? I'm gonna go through all the desk stuff. Cross. Nothing. All right, another open top box. Let's see what's in this open top box. Oh, this is a little exciting. We got a pair of shorts. Ralph Lauren vintage. Nice tie. All right, I'm teasing you guys. This is what I saw that was exciting looking in there. Look at this. We got a York Grand Rapids. And we got a Dressel Arlington Red Railroad Glass Lantern. That is nice. That is probably a good 50 bucks just for the lantern. And then we're back to a bunch of junk. We got a VCR tape, some clothes. Is there a Rolex on the bottom of this? They destroyed this. Whoever went through this stuff went through it vigorously. It's just everything tossed upside down that you could possibly think of. Tranquility in a bottle. What else? What is this? Neiman Marcus. And that's it. No Rolex. That's still cool though. I like finding those two little items we got. Another pearl. Now I don't know why I didn't want to jump back and finish these ones yet. What do we got here? Marth Gibraltar. Gibraltar, whatever it is. What's the name of like that one? Arizona. No. Marble. Vintage is good, but not the right stuff on most of them. 1992, the Roundup. Okay. Grill and bar. Um, which cat here for me? Nope, 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 nope. 
Are you going to wall it? Licensed by Harley Davidson. That's a five or ten dollar bill. It's got no money. Tiffany's Cabaret Playboy. Nice. Okay. Boring, boring, boring. What do we got here? Personal paperwork. No. Business stuff. Georgetown. That's a nice shirt. What do we got here? Railroad conductors? Nope, but they're jer jerbod. Save that from a guy. Okay, that's a wrap. We did really good on the one box of trains I found out of the Ah, we're making a bloody mess. Okay, oh, Gravis Gamepad. That's kind of cool. Cafe, maybe. Mm, nothing cool in the vintage shirt department. That kind of sucked. More to walk in there. Personal stuff here. That's what that looks like. All pretty. Yep. Sealed box. And it's not even completely sealed. See how it's been resealed at some point? Cut and then a new seal put on. Come on. Be something intriguing for daddy. Um, class of 94. Oh, that got real boring real quick. downhill real fast. Come on, let's keep it coming. Keep going, keep high. Curve by Claiborne. No, don't take it personal. Okay, some baseball cards. Do we have a rare Babe Ruth in here? No, no. Dennis Eckersley. Roger Clemens. No. Let's see. Ooh. Which Walter Payton is this? Super action Walter Payton. 1981 tops. George Brett, all star. Another Walter Payton right there. I have to look at those cards. Are those aren't. Ooh. Is that a Mark McGuire rookie now? No. Close to it, though. Interesting. Throw up emoji. Shout out to all my cowboy fans out there. Mainly you, baby girl. You're watching. Probably aren't now in you. Come and watch your videos, Dad. You're boring. Set row. Personal paperwork. We're making a mess. Getting yelled at by the manager here. No. No more lock box. Okay. Knee brace. Okay. 
garbage ass. It's not even personal paperwork. They didn't really want to take nothing back to this facility. A cashier's check. No. There's a gift card. It's gone. That sucks. Ooh. Conference Champions 1998. Atlanta Disney Channel, that's kind of cool. Right, white tree decorations. Nice. Right off the bat, we're looking at Waterford. It's kind of boring. 1996. Here I graduated high school. Well, I got my GD, I should say. Not bad, $34.99. And what else do we have here? That's, oh yeah. That's the way the cookie crumbles. Those are kind of cool. So they must have like an all white tree and they just did the all white ornaments on there. St. Thomas. Diane, we'll have to look at the open top box. Um, what the hell is that? A freaking deer, it's a deer with a missing leg. That is not what you want to see. Okay, coffee cup, no. Alright, shelf paper. Shelf paper. Let's... The Papiaka. Okay. Plates. Mary who had a little lamb. Really not gonna open up all these. I can tell you they're cups and dishes and little pieces to that china set that we've been showing through. But what we wanna do is make sure that there's not a china set at the bottom. Here look, I'll show you. We'll see if I wasn't here. Remember this set here? Oh, these are not, actually these are plates. Plates of little bags. Elvis, everybody likes Elvis. Funky, funky, one thing we Oh, all sorts of plates under here. On a dish pack, the good stuff is at the bottom. The top stuff is usually cups and bull crap like that. Oh, now that is neat. See, let's get to the bottom. I'm gonna pull them all out from the bottom of this and then we're gonna go through and look at these plates. Okay, well, I was kind of bamboozled. After going through there, almost all of them were empty. And the plates are in the packaging, wrapped in paper. So I'll have to go through and find them all. Happy 50th birdie. Happy 50th birthday, not birdie, Tweety. That was nice. See, they were all like this. The plates are stuck inside of there, wrapped up. I'm going to have to go through certificate of authenticity for Lou Gehrig. Maybe that's in there. Ooh, Pepe Le Pew. Oh, ho, 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 wee, oui, wee. Oui. And this course is for you. The rest were all empty like the one, so I'm gonna have to go through them and find those. Plates. All right, here we go again. Cups and sports plates. Um, we something good. Can we say, can we have a china set in here? I mean, uh, silver set, sterling silver. Be a book safe? Nope, be a book safe. $100,000? No. No. Ooh. I'm feeling something like coming out. Could it be a Babe Ruth baseball too? That's kind of neat. 
Be Babe Ruth. No. World Series Baseball, 1987. Interesting. It's not signed, but still neat. Ooh. Now that is interesting. Made in Japan. Wow. That could be some money right there. It's weird how you could just steal when it's a good item. What it takes to be number one. I read this recently somewhere. Winning is not a sometimes thing. It's an all the time thing. You don't win once in a while. You don't do things right once in a while. You do them right all the time. Winning is a habit. Unfortunately, so is losing. There is no room for second place. Your first or last, Ricky Bobby. There is only one place in my game, and that's first place. I have finished second twice in my time at Green Bay, and I don't ever want to finish second again. Love Vince Finbardi for that. I'm going to keep that in there on my wall. Mm -hmm. 1975 World Series home runs. Nice. These all baseball things? What are they? Ooh, ooh. Look at that. Nice. This isn't this one is actually a decent box brother. So far, so good. Oh, Mike Schmidt, no, uh, yeah, Mike Schmidt, nice. Dan Marino, you know who we're giving that to? Baby Jeebus. This one's for Alex right here. That almost looks signed. The catch. Great moments. Second greatest quarterback ever. Second to Steve Young. Ooh, Cal Ripken Jr. Look at that play. Rookie of the year. Ted Williams with the baseball bat. That's nice. That is nice. Ooh, this box is getting good right here. What do we got here? Lou Gehrig. We found the plate box in the other one, so when I get to the market tomorrow, I will go through that one a little better. It's been so long since I found a Babe Ruth autograph, guys. One of my best finds ever. I'll, I'm, I'm always waiting for the next Babe Ruth autograph. All the time, I, I tell myself, it's today the day that we're gonna knock it out the park and we're gonna find a Babe Ruth baseball again. Who in the heck is this? Phrase Fresnos. If you know boxing, fighting let me know i'm going to show this to jeebus because jeebus likes boxing fighting oh come on keep it coming Hoo -hoo. what the giants evitz what is this where played Ebbets Field, Yankees. What is this? Comment below if this is an actual scorebook used by the actual league, or is this something you took on your own? I'm scared to touch this. Giants, Ebbets Field, shows the people. 
This is just a trip right here. I don't even want to touch this. I don't know what. Look, it even has Gehrig's name in there. This person saw Gehrig, and this, this is the actual one. Um, I don't know. That is a trip right there. Great seal of the state of Arkansas, gift number one. That's kind of cool. Let's set that in a good pile. Ooh, coin collection? Found coin collection. I bought an abandoned storage unit. Everything's a coin collection nowadays. Ooh, ooh. What is this? That is a trip. I don't think that's... I don't know what this is. I like it though because it's a Pirates. The Whaler Indian off Tahiti. That is nice too. This box right here, come on Rolex, come on something just amazing that I've never found before. New York Yankees, limited edition, Major League Baseball, New York Yankees, New York Yankees, their pens, and that is a nice cup. Official world champions in 1996. That's not bad either. Here. First stamps and first day covers. Okay. What is this? Ooh. Dang. This postcard looks very valuable right here. Jack Dempsey knocks out Jess Willard, Champions of the World. That looks almost hand painted to me. And then these are just first day covers of sports. So look, Olympics. Olympics. These are probably not a very good value here. Believe it or not, first day covers don't bring a lot. But this postcard right there, I'm going to have to have that looked up for sure. Can that be what's on here? Let me look here again. Jack Dempsey, no. All right, let's keep it going here. Uh, I'm just excited. This got me a little excited. What's up, Doc? What's up, Doc? Can we rock? What's up, Doc? Can we rock? Piece of glass. Super Bowl. First. Interesting. We'll keep that aside. Maybe Alex will like that. Come on, Rolex box. Ooh, the imitation of Christ. That sounds like a Bible. American Airlines. Massachusetts Joe. All right. Not. Not a Rolex box. Joe, best wishes. Let's give that to Uncle Michael. Who is that? Audrey Hepburn? I don't, I don't know what that says. It's what it looks like it says to me. Now, I have to find the other football that I just tossed aside to look like crap because that one, what did I do with that? It went somewhere. We'll find when we put everything.
then we got paper. Holy Grail underneath this big old thing of paperwork. Opening day, Rockies, Colorado, limited edition. Uh -huh. Yeah, a freaking printer. Oh well. I'm not gonna complain because that gave me a little bit of excitement seeing all that decent stuff there. Here is the other. Here is the other one I found right here. Best wishes. Maybe you guys can we figure who that is. And with that being said, that is the end of this unboxing. We still have this one wall back and maybe like 10 boxes to go tops. And we found some cool stuff in there. Nice Christmas ornaments, sports plates, computer programs. I think this might be worth some money. I actually pulled it back out because I think it might be worth money new in the box railroad lamps we found sports memorabilia that was actually a really good box at there at the end this toy right here who knows what this thing is worth i think that's a really good box we're gonna find some money maybe in those last few boxes